what's up y'all it's your girl kaya and i'm back with another video thank you guys so much for tuning in if you're new here what's up my name is kaya and you are tuning into my youtube channel it must be kai definitely hit that like comment and subscribe button before we get right into this video where i'm going to be talking about my top three products for this spring to get the best wash and go so if you're interested in my top three definitely stay tuned Alright y'all, so I just wanted to come to y'all with a quick video, okay? I live here in Georgia and the weather is currently starting to break. I am feeling better. It was allergies, okay, that I was going through. I was sick in my last video. If you don't know, definitely go check that video out. That video is currently doing numbers. It is a wash and go with me. So definitely check that video, video out before you come over here to this one. Thanks. And speaking of wash and go with me, in this video, I'm really just going to be sharing with y'all my top three products to get the best spring wash and go okay because spring is approaching us it's literally that time of the season okay the weather is starting to warm back up i know if some of us deal with stuff with our mood in the winter just really seeing the sun come out like y'all the sun was up until i think it started going and i think the sun started going down around seven today and i was just so happy i think it was like 6 45 ish and the sun was still up and the weather is just so nice there's pollen on my car i hate it but i love to see it because that means winter is finally getting the up out of here okay because your girl was over it but speaking of that these products that i'm going to be sharing with you are basically washing goes that i have done over the course of this past year maybe even longer but i've done all these washing goes on my channel so now i'm able to come to you and tell you which ones i recommend for the springtime because i don't know about y'all but some products i prefer more in the winter than i do in the spring and summer because i just like a different type a wash and go sometimes if you know sometimes i like a crunchy sleek wash and go and other times i like a wash and go like the one that i have currently that's just has a ton of movement to it a ton of fluff and all that stuff so i really fluctuate between the type of wash and goes that i like sometimes i like the side part sleek uniform baby hair and other times i like free wash and goes like this so these products that i'm going to be sharing with you are the ones that i I'm gonna be using this spring and summer coming up unless I try something else that gets my heart okay so let's go ahead and get right into number one all right y'all so number one is an OG it has made my top wash and go products multiple times across my channel the first one is the Camille Rose curl maker I love this product when it comes to spring and summer wash and goes oh my goodness this it this is always gonna be one of my jams i know i tried the uncle funky's daughter and uncle funky's daughter is very similar to this however i haven't had a chance to try uncle funky's daughter more than one time so i really haven't mastered it so maybe that will make the list when it comes to the summertime but as far as spring coming up and the type of wash and go that i'm looking for camille rose curl maker is definitely gonna give me that wash and go i don't have a lot of it left at all just because like i said this product is a little bit pricey so when I do do this wash and go it's typically for a special occasion but when we're speaking of the spring and the type of wash and goes that I'm gonna like in the spring I really like my large kind of boohoo just like free-flowing wash and goes i really just don't like the whole uniform look per se all the time so in the springtime i'm definitely going to be using this product here because i prefer wash and goes like this in the spring and summer i like it when they blow in the wind it just it just makes just i just love it okay this is just the look that i usually go for when it starts to warm up okay and i do find that i am a lot cooler and i can just wake up shake and go okay so this is the type of wash and go that i like during that time of year and this is going to give me that the camille rose curl maker if you have not seen my one product wash and go on this product definitely go check it out i did it a long time ago on my channel so you're gonna have to scroll a bit but i'll be sure to link it down below in the description box so you can see what type of wash and go it gives me but it does give a soft wash and go is that it's gonna give you that soft blow in the wind wash and go it's gonna have shine and it's just gonna be 
literally chef's kiss okay so this is going in my number one spot of the products that I'm gonna be using to get the perfect spring wash and go. So we're just gonna move right on to number two. Okay y'all, so battling it out for the number two spot. Even though these are in no particular order, sometimes I just be like, ooh, I don't know which one I wanna talk about next. But the next one coming in is going to be Aunt Jackie's Curl Boss, okay? This product right here is spring approved baby and let me tell you why okay so this product does give your wash and go a bit more of a hold it does it's a very strong hold and your curls are going to be clumped together and very defined okay however this wash and go lasts so long if i had to say which wash and go was my longest lasting wash and go it would be this one i could not remember what day i did my wash and go on my my curls were so clumped together and so defined for so long I was like dang when did I do this wash and go and I really I literally washed it out on day six but it really could have went longer this has to be my longest lasting wash and go and that's why I'm gonna say for the spring you need this in your collection if you want that perfect wash and go okay so with this product it's gonna give you just a little bit of crunch not too much it's really more clumping and then it makes the curls soft okay you're not gonna get a whole lot of crunch with this and you're gonna get more movement as well but literally y'all uh, it looked like i was walking around with a braid out or a twist out okay that's how formed together my curls were and this wash and go lasts so long so that's why i'm gonna recommend it for the spring and also too i was just able to wear my hair even when it did rain no matter the weather because it was a little funky that week when i did try this product out again and my hair literally stayed defined the entire time like right now i do have a little bit of frizz in the front but this product right here this is a force to be reckoned with i am running low on it i really only have just a little bit of it left but but I am going to be re-upping on this product because this has to be in my collection for the spring because this is going to be one of my go-to wash and goes this spring and this summer just because it lasts long I feel like you could even do this wash and go when you're about to go on vacation so if any of y'all are going on spring break you can do this wash and go and not have to replenish it not have to refresh it or anything like that because your hair is literally going to stay clumped together it's going to stay soft it's going to stay shiny and it's going to last like you can go on your spring break vacation and come back and your hair is still going to look brand spanking new okay because that's just what i experienced you know what i'm saying like i did put a lot of product in i did use a lot of it okay i'll say that i used a lot of it but it is thick and it's heavy so i say if you're going on vacation this spring doing anything spring break related put this in your hair your wash and go is going to last your entire vacation this goes in my number two spot this is definitely going to be getting used all spring long so let's go ahead and get into to the final one all right y'all so the final wash and go that i recommend for the springtime is going to be the one that i currently have in my head now okay so like i was saying earlier when it comes to the spring and summer i just prefer a different type of wash and go i really like the fluffy like you could barely see my part like no edges slick down like none of that i really just like the free form wash and go like i love wearing like y'all it's about to be sundress season okay i cannot wait to wear my sundress and my curls just out they just being free they have a lot of movement to them as well like my hair has a ton of a movement it's super defined still but it's big and that's just what i really really like this is a big fluffy wash and go yet it is still defined but it's not defined all over it's really just like a bed head type of thing but anyway coming in my last spot on my top three is going to be this wash and go that i currently have right now which is the do big papa defining gel okay so i know y'all did not probably expect for this to make the lineup like this is like a so like this is like a surprise 
surprise, okay? But yes, this did make my spring lineup. I really, really enjoy the way this wash and go came out, okay? It came out super duper defined and it fluffed. It just, it has so much movement to it. I went outside today and the wind was just blowing through my hair and it was just all over the place. And then when I shake it, it just, all the movement. And this was really giving spring, you know what I'm saying? Like this was giving me that boho feel. Like I felt like spring today. And I feel like as a black woman, I should be allowed to feel like spring and have my hair in the wind, okay? So this product did it for me. The last time I wore my hair with this product, it was really, really cold outside. So it's very interesting to be able to try out new products with a new season because I did acquire a good amount of these products during the fall and winter months. So it's really interesting to see how they're performing in the spring, especially as the temperature is starting to creep up and the sun is shining longer all day, okay? I can't wait till the sun starts setting at 8 p.m. Like, I cannot wait. But anyway, this wash and go is going to be this wash and go here. I still have definition, I have frizz, it's not super uniform, it's not super defined, but it's literally giving me that look that I want this spring and summer, like the real, like I rolled out of bed and the sun is shining and it's 75 degrees. Like it's giving, that's the look that I want. That's the look that I'm going for, okay? But I do feel like with these products that I did name, you can do that uniform look if you would like. Like I know if I wanna gel it down and do a part on the side real uniform like, I can get that look with these products. But at the same time, they're still giving me exactly the type of look that I would need and that I want for the spring springtime it can withstand the weather the humidity it don't catch no pollen in it baby but this is literally what i'm looking for and the do big papa really provides that look that i that i ultimately go for the aesthetic that i go for for the spring which is fresh flowing boho like that's just the feel that i like because the weather is just so beautiful okay it's just so beautiful so i know y'all are probably wondering about other products and why they did not make the cut but i do feel like some of the other products they were heavier to with stand that cold and lock in moisture we always want to lock in moisture however when it comes to the springtime we don't have to try as hard because just the wind chill and the air isn't going against our hair and it's not super harsh on our hair so that's why i don't really have a bunch of heavy gels i mean these are heavy gels but like that's why certain products didn't make the cut this time because they they were a little heavy on my hair to where my hair wasn't blowing in the wind like y'all know when your wash and go is too crunchy your hair blow in the wind like this like it it do like this like it blows like this i wanted my hair to blow and move in the wind okay i hope i make them some sense anyway that just brings us to the end i'm ending it off my top three with the do big papa all right y'all so i thank you guys so so much for tuning into this video of my top three i hope y'all enjoyed let me know what your top three products are down in the comments for the springtime also let me know how you like your wash and goes like do y'all be in different moods sometimes because sometimes i like that uniform sleek heart curls wash and go like giving bob okay and other times i like a wash and go like this that's giving straight out of bed straight out of I like to look like I frolic, okay? This is my, that, that's what type of wash and go I'ma call this, okay? My frolicking wash and go. Like I'm running through a meadow or running on the beach. That's what type of wash and go I want for this time of year, okay? So let me know what type of wash and go y'all like. Do y'all like the sleek wash and go or do y'all like the free form frolicking wash and go, okay? But thank you guys so, so much for tuning into this video. I hope y'all enjoyed and I will see you in the next one.